If you are active duty military and you are thinking about getting involved in real estate but are trying to figure out, like, how could you make that happen when you're busy, you know, protecting the country, right? How can you have that happen? Well, I am glad that you came here to this video to try to get some information on that, right? Because what I am doing is helping people just like you do just that, right? Today, I'm working with Matt and Brittany. Uh, you guys are from Jersey, but both of you are active duty military, right? We got Matt in the Air Force, uh, Brittany in the Navy. And while you guys are busy with your day jobs, your careers, keeping the U.S. of A safe, thank you for your service, I will be here trying to keep your money safe, analyzing real estate deals, taking a look at properties, helping you pick the right investments, then providing you uh, with property management, maintenance, construction, insurance, you know, the whole boots on the ground stuff you're going to need, right? And today, I got a triplex for you two in a great little market. It's only going to cost 26 k Let's go. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%, that's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Howdy, 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 y'all. Let's friggin' jump into her. Jump into it. Er, it, whatevs. This property, right? I think this is going to make some sense, man. This is going to make some sense, right? Just hit the market today. That's what I do, folks. You work with me, I jump on it with a quickness, right? You got to move fast. This one's going to be gobbled up, okay? 1120 East Ave, Elyria, Ohio, 44035, right? First thing we'll do, right? Let's pull up some cool-ass photos, right? Now, what you're going to see here is not, I repeat, not, Going to titillate your juices, okay? It's not going to make you go, what is so beautiful, okay? This is C-grade investing, folks, all right? Yes, are those some spare tires by the garbage? Yes, they are, okay? But this game, it ain't as sexy as y'all believe, okay? It ain't, ain't as sexy as the gurus lead you out to believe, all right? This is what it really looks like, right? You're dealing with moderately low-income folk, okay? Uh, but... This kind of stuff, the numbers are going to make some sense, right? So don't think it's all fancy. It's really not. If you're trying to buy a three-unit apartment building for only twenty-six grand out of your pocket, this is what it's going to look like. This is the life of a C-grade real estate investor in the Cleveland market, right? Speaking of the Cleveland market, let's speak about the Cleveland market, right? Because y'all be watching the show. Oh, no. Oh, man. Hold on. Oh, no. Oh, Technical difficulties. How y'all doing? Now, y'all be watching the show uh, from all over, right? All over the world, all over the country, right? We've worked with investors from France. We've worked with investors in the UK, investors all over the USA, right? And a lot of people choose the Cleveland market because the Cleveland market is a low-cost market. It's a red state. It's a good cash-flowing uh, area, right? But not a lot of people have ever heard of the city of Lyria. It's about a half hour west of Cleveland. Uh, the city of Cleveland itself is not uh, all there is to the Cleveland market. We got like 4 million people out here in this market where Holton Wise operates our property management business. And only 300,000 of them live in the city of Cleveland, right? I don't live in the city of Cleveland, okay? Uh, so there's a lot going on in the Cleveland market that's not Cleveland. And I think this particular property, right, I think this house, this dupe or this triplex rather in the city of Illyria, I think this is a better opportunity than what you actually see in the city of Cleveland. It's a little bit more landlord friendly over there, right? You don't got those new pesky lead paint laws, which if you ain't ever heard of those and you're thinking about investing in Cleveland, check that video out. It's in the notes below, dude. You're going to need to know that if you're going to invest in Cleveland, right? So this sneaky little area, right? Uh, it's not sexy right but you know similar housing stock of what you'll get in the in the city of cleveland but out here in Elyria, i think you get property priced better because i don't think a lot of people know about it right i don't think a lot of people are paying attention like look at that that's a brand spanking new furnace right there three brand spanking new hot water tanks that's big stuff right so this deal right uh, 1120 East Avenue, Illyria, just hit the market today, as I said, for 105000 This is a triplex. The current rents, okay, uh, this is what the tenants are currently paying. This is per the seller, per the listing agent. Five and a quarter, five fifty, six fifty, right? 
uh, market rents, right, what they should actually be charging, what Holton Wise would work to increase the rents up to, uh, 650, 650, 850. So that's 2150 or 25,800 a year, right? You ain't going to find a property priced like this in the city of Cleveland. So, again, uh, Leary is a nice sneaky little uh, little town to find some some really good deals, right? So uh, if we are able to get the rent up to market rent without uh, removing anybody, how much money would uh, this thing kick off, right? What would it reasonably look like? Well, twenty one fifty a month would come in. I'd anticipate you'd spend around $1,009 operating it. Fixed, variable expense estimates, right? So I think, all told, you're really making about 13 and a half for the year. You only put down 26, lender kicks in 78. You're looking at like a 34% cash-on-cash return projection if we can get the tenants up to market. Now, it's possible when you go to increase the rent, somebody moves out, and based upon those photos, I'm sure we're spending at least five grand to turn the unit, get it spiffy, Nobody's going to come into it when it's a little grimy like that and pay market rent, right? I mean, once you move in there, you can deal with your own grime, but you ain't moving into something with somebody else's grime. That don't make no darn sense. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but these are the kind of deals uh, that could be had. So with this one, uh, it's not a question of do I believe this is a good deal uh, do I think this one makes a sense? It's can you move fast enough and aggressive enough to get the opportunity to buy it? Because I could almost guarantee you this one will be gone in a matter of days and the seller is going to have multiple offers because it just makes too much sense. Let me know what you want to do. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.